Weather in the Pacific Northwest has been grabbing headlines the last couple of years. From last summer's deadly heat wave to wildfires that destroyed over a million acres in Oregon during the Labor Day weekend of 2020. Ridges are a normal part of our weather in any, actually really any part of the middle latitudes, but here in the Pacific Northwest is no exception. So why are we seeing stronger weather patterns in the summer? And we're using a combination of these historical observations and computer models to understand what drives the occurrence of these ridges. Paul Loiketh is an associate professor of geography and director of Portland State University's Climate Science Lab. He's teaming up with Deebdee Singh, an assistant professor for the School of the Environment with Washington State University, Vancouver. Together, they are studying atmospheric ridge patterns and the impact they have on our weather. Things that go on in the land surface could potentially influence um, ridging with changes in soil moisture. So these are the types of mechanisms that we're going to take a closer look at. Atmospheric ridges or high pressure systems bring in calmer weather and are associated with drier and sunny conditions. They can also be responsible for heat waves during the summer months. What, what are the drivers of ridges and potentially how can we predict those? What's the predictability? And ultimately, when we want to manage you know, extreme events, what we want is predictability. Both Loiketh and Singh want to know the factors that are contributing to our warmer summers over the last few years. One thing they're looking closely at. Are we going to get larger heat waves or larger droughts, um, as well as how the severity and um, the frequency of, of extreme events at the surface. They're also going to be paying close attention to sea surface temperatures. But then there are relationships between our circulation and what's going on in the central tropical Pacific. So El Nino and La Nina events can influence our circulation. And to see how other weather patterns could be playing a role in our changing climate. This is a three-year project that just started between Portland State and Washington State. Both Paul and Deepti, who you just heard from, tell me they're also going to be looking into how these ridges can contribute to wildfires.